Hi everyone, it's a Stitch Fix Day. So anyway, I hope you stick around and join me and help me decide what I should keep. Hi everyone, I'm Nancy and welcome back to my channel. To my returning viewers, my subscribers, thank you guys so much for taking time out of your day to spend with me. It means more to me than I can ever let you know. So thank you everyone from the bottom of my heart. If you are new to my channel, please hit that little red subscribe button over there. I would love to have you come back and join me for future videos. And today we're doing Stitch Fix. I had so much fun with this box. I really did. And I'm so excited because I have the same stylist. And that is just is so important to me to kind of maintain a relationship. And she gets to know what you like, what you don't like. And yeah, so thank you, Mackenzie. I was so excited to see that you styled me again. But anyway, if you are new to Stitch Fix, I'm going to have a little video up here that's going to explain everything that you need to know about Stitch Fix. I'll also have a note down in my description below. And also, if you are new to Stitch Fix and you use my link below, you would get a $25 credit to use in your first Stitch Fix box. I would get a $25 credit as well to use on future fixes. My link is going to take you right to the Stitch Fix page where you're going to do a quick questionnaire about your styles and sizes, things like that, you likes, you don't likes. And then you get a box that's going to be curated especially for you. And of course, I've already ripped apart my box, but every box is going to come with a prepaid mailer to send anything back to through the post office, anything that you don't like, you don't want to keep, or something you need to exchange for a different size. Shipping free both ways. Love that. So anyway, you're also going to get a stylus note. And here I got a really nice detailed note from Mackenzie. And I so appreciate that. So if you freeze this, if you wanted to, I won't take the time to read it, but it just, um, you know, she goes on about how she read my feedback and my likes, my dislikes. Uh, I mentioned about the, the shoes that I got last time that were just so hard. There was no cushioning. Um, in my preview, I had a pair of shoes that look, really looked nice and promising, but I couldn't tell on the heel size. And I just said that, you know, I really would like to keep it under three inches, like two and a half is like my perfect size. She took the time to measure the shoes and to let me know it was a two and a half inch heel so i think that's going above and beyond the call of duty so thank you so much mackenzie so you're also going to get your invoice and of course you can freeze this if there's something that's here that you would like to ask your stylist for so it's going to be the items here the colors the sizes and of course the price so again you can freeze that i think i've got everything in there and my box, everything in my box was $281. If I were to keep all, and we call that, when you keep all five items, you get a discount. We call that a five, four, five, and you get 25% off. So that is really awesome. So if I were to keep everything in this box, I would get $70.25 off. Um, that would bring it down to $210.75. I just paid for my styling pass that renewed, so I've got a $49 credit here. So if I were to keep everything in this box, it would be $161.75. I 
already. So first, let's get into the first item here. And I'm just going to go in order here. So as you remember, my last Stitch Fix box, I had maxis that were all just a little bit too long. There was one thing that wasn't. It was a perfect length. I just couldn't justify $78 for the skirt, but I loved it. And this first item she picked for me, it's a maxi skirt from Love Appella. It's called the Cameron Brushed Nix Mixed. No, it's not mixed. This is the Love Appella Cameron Brush Knit Maxi Skirt. Oh, yeah. Sometimes things are harder than they should be, right? So this is uh, color black. It's a size small, $48. This is so, so soft. It's uh, that brushed knit again. And the flowers in here are all like this cream colored white. I think it just looks really nice. It's soft. It's pretty. It's comfortable on. you got this wide waistband. It's just really super comfortable. It's $48. Perfect, perfect length on me. I wore everything in the try-on with the shoes that came in this box, but I could wear this easily with my little slide-on sketchers, or I could wear it with my sneakers. I could wear it with my air shoes. Perfect, perfect length. Going into winter, I could put this with a black sweater and wear it with my black booties. Yeah, yeah. I'm thinking about winter already. Yeah, crazy, huh? Anyway, I'm thinking of keeping this because I love it. So I'd love to hear what you thought about this. Alrighty, so next we have these shoes that are so stinking cute. It's just not fair to the other shoes. They're so cute. So anyway, they've got this Espergel design here. Nice wedge. I'm hoping this pattern comes out. So again, this is a poppy open toe wedge from Violet and Red, off white, size seven, eighty nine dollars. Can you see the detail on the knot here? And it's like the subtle, subtle animal print really really cute and the last shoes i sent back because there was no cushioning there was no support these are super super cushioned right here under the ball of the feet super super cushioned right here under the heel these are adorable i love these but i'm sending them back and it's going to be hard to do and during the try on i mean i, I wore it with my little no show sneaker sock things but um my foot just kept sliding onto these so I know that means blister in my world when your feet keep sliding out or you're going to trip on them. So for that reason, these are going back, but it's going to be hard because if I had a job where I could sit all day and people would do my bid and calling and yeah, I would take them in a heartbeat. But unfortunately, the guys don't wait on me hand and foot. So yeah, for that reason, these are going back, but these are so stinking cute. I really love these. Again, $89. All right. So next is the top that I'm wearing, which I'm thinking about keeping but I'm not really positive so I really need your help on this so this is the fortune and ivy it's called the casein casein split neck blouse black size small it's $38 the front of it is that crepey polyester that I'm not really a fan of it's got this crisscross detail right here that I know a lot of people are over but I'm not I think it's really a fun detail I think it still doesn't take away so that if I still wanted to wear a necklace it's I don't think it's too much um bar was in here it's probably not going to show up but it's got like a white outline and then some of them have this peachy apricot color i think that is so pretty it is a mixed media that i'm really not a fan of because the back although the back is soft soft material it clings to every lump bump nook and cranny that there is if you had a dimple in your back these shirts find it yeah it doesn't have any problem with me because it's back fat so that's why I'm thinking about sending it back. I know the back isn't flattering. I'm not a fan of this crepey polyester, but I love the style of it. I love the pattern. I think with jeans and a jean jacket at work or a cardigan, no one's going to see my back fat. I don't know. So tell me what you think about this one. Your honest opinions, please. This one is $38. Next, we have this 41 Hawthorne top. And I think this really looked nice with the maxi top. So this, again, it's 41 Hawthorne. It's the Sutton Mix material bell sleeves white size small this is $68 sleeves have this really cute bell detail on it the bell sleeve detail like a little tulip here really really pretty back has this little keyhole and a little button but you don't have to undo that it was nice and stretchy here so you could just put it right on over it's like a wrap, but it does have like this built-in camisole that's attached, so it's not going to slide down like other camisoles that come in a set. So it just makes it look you got like this keyhole right here. It makes it look like a keyhole where it shows that camisole. 
it's gathered right here a little bit at the bottom so it kind of makes it look like you've got a little front tuck going on the back is that mixed media so it's nice soft and stretchy and just a little bit longer not a lot the front is that 100% polyester that's the crepey crepey material same as this the crepey crepey material this one maybe because it's $68 and it's both layers so it's got two layers of that itchy crepey material but the back even though it's that mixed media I think the fit was better on this in the back I didn't at least I, I couldn't tell from looking in the monitor that the back fat showed as bad I think with the skirt it looked really nice for $68 and it's this crepey crepey material so I'm thinking of sending this back but let me know what you think about that because I am kind of on the fence because it did look nice with the skirt I think it did anyway but then I really couldn't see the back but let me know your thoughts on that $68 lastly we have another top from fortune and ivy and this one is called the Margaret keyhole detail and in the back it's got this button right here little keyhole this one because it's a the band right here um, wasn't as stretchy so I did have to undo that button to get it on which I'm not a fan of the back is a little bit longer than the front it's nice rounded that stretch stretchy for the mixed media front does have this little keyhole that I thought was really cute the sleeves here it's sleeveless but it's got like this hem folded over and it is tacked down so it just kind of gives a fun little cap detail sleeve which I think is a nice flattering fit up here if you if you don't especially if you want to cover your shoulders or something like that but for me and again this is $38 but again the front of this is at 100% polyester that's the crepey feeling the really crepey yeah, yeah, I don't know how to explain it it's probably not the best word but it's it's itchy it feels cheap and itchy even though it looks cute it looks adorable I love the style of it but just really not a fan of the crepe crepey feeling so why do I like this one maybe this one it's a little bit thinner maybe it's not as itchy this one is itchy and hot the white one's itchy and hot I don't know so that's what I'm thinking about I'm thinking about keeping this but I'm really not positive kind of depends on how that back fat looks in it because sometimes you do get hot and you take your cardigan off and you walk around work and I don't want people staring at my back fat you know what I mean I do love this skirt though so anyway I would love to hear your comments or read your comments I can't hear them unless you call me and tell me about it but yeah so I would love to read your comments I hope you give this video a like and uh, help my channel grow it really does mean a lot to me your support is amazing and I can't thank you guys enough so anyway thanks for spending some time with me today I hope you go out and have a fantastic day I have no idea why mr. mr. Griffin's already sleeping so anyway I hope he makes an appearance later because I got some more unboxings to do so anyway have a great day everyone and we will chat again soon bye bye